guys, it's Anna Bienvenido otra vez a mi canal. If you are new here though, what is up? So I am not supposed to be spending money. I am like in the middle of just a life change, I guess. So I'm just trying to like reevaluate my entire life and everything. So I'm not supposed to be shopping, but here we are with a TJ Maxx and Marshalls haul. I have so much going on. It has been a very tough year. Um, I think I still need to do kind of like an update because there's just been so much happening But I'm, like I said, I'm not supposed to be spending money But sometimes I just need the retail therapy and you guys know I love TJ Maxx. I love Marshalls I've put off shopping there for so long I've only done like videos here and there of like hauls and stuff and some stuff has been bought for me Which I'm so thankful for so let's just get on into this haul. I'm just not even gonna talk about it too much more It's all makeup for this haul. I'm super excited. I wanted to get this video up for you guys though so you guys can see some of the stuff that I felt like was worth spending my little bit of monies on um, if you're out TJ Maxx and Marshalls because there's so much to choose from especially now with the holidays coming out there's so much good stuff at the store but this is some of the stuff that I felt like needed to come home with me so like I said this is all makeup I'm gonna try to keep the brands and stuff together and also I am drinking eggnog while we do this so <laughs> already almost made a huge mess okay Popcorn box of makeup, obviously. It's not too, too much. First, I'm gonna mention something that I got from Nordstrom Rack online because it is something I have wanted since they came out and I just could never justify spending the full price for them and I could never find this specific one in store. It is just the Lancome Juicy Shakers in Mint To Be. So it's the blue one that's just like mint. I wanted it since it came out, okay? But I couldn't justify, these are $22, even still on the Lancome website. And it's kind of hard sometimes to find them on like Macy's and stuff. But so I picked these up, they were only like $12 a piece. So I finally got my hands on it. Now I'm obsessed, I love it. And I'm, I'm just so happy with them. And so like I said, I got them from the online website, NordstromRacket.com. So you guys know I'm weird sometimes about getting like stuff for my lips because I'm not trying to get anything on my lips, you know? But since it came from online, I feel comfortable buying them and using them. But I got one, two, three. And I didn't even get different colors. I was going to, but I was like, but this is really the one that made me want any at all. And I really only wanted this one, the blue one, the mint to be. So I got three of the same ones. <laughs> if anyone wants to give me anything for Christmas, I'll just take all of those. Honestly. Then I guess quickly I'm just gonna mention this. My birthday is not, my birthday's already passed. Um, but I picked up the free gift from Ulta. I just want to remind you guys because I feel like. I almost forgot, which is crazy. Get your free makeup stuff from Ulta and Sephora. I didn't get my free gift from Sephora, and usually, like, every other year, it's been, like, even past your birthday, you can go pick up your free gift, but I don't think they do that anymore, which is super annoying. So I picked up my free gift from Ulta. I just want to show you guys if you care. Uh, it's just a little mini NARS lipstick, but it looks like something that you would get from, like, TJ Maxx and Marshalls, honestly, and they would try to charge $6. It's, it's cute. It's just a little NARS lipstick, and who doesn't like NARS? But this is just in the color color for pour toujours which I think means for today Maybe. this is my eggnog concoction that we're drinking here it's not keto so she's strong I kind of don't know why this is in here because I've already mentioned like the wet and wild stuff that I got from oh this is one that I got from Ulta but I think I actually ended up finding it at Rite Aid for cheaper if you guys saw that haul of like all the Rite Aid was it just Rite Aid um but I mentioned one of these I accidentally got the same color because the one at Rite Aid ended up being cheaper but it's just wet and wild liquid cat suit you've already seen it so I don't know why it's in here but so then this looks like it came from TJ Maxx maybe? I don't know, it was on clearance, so it was from one of those stores. It is just the Anastasia Beverly Hills. It's the single eyeshadow. It's in a color that I didn't have yet. It's in the color Prussian, Prussian, Prussian blue. I could be saying that wrong, but I got it marked down. It was only $3. I think the original price, if I can take this off, $3.99. So I saved 99 cents, but I love getting these because I think if you get these from like Ulta still, they're like 10 or $12 a piece, okay? So I've got a nice little collection going of my Anastasia Beverly Hills eyeshadows and Anastasia just is like it in my book. So just some really pretty blue. Like, super excited. Oh, I guess I'll mention this because I only got one thing from Becca. It is one of these. It is the Becca Ocean Jewels collection. It is the eyeshadow palette. I got this from TJ Maxx. It was only $16.99. 
so excited about this. Um, if I can get it out. It is just beautifulness. I think I saw one of the highlighter palettes, but it was like totally shattered and I was upset. So I only picked up this guy. But these can also be used, um, I think some of these as highlighters maybe, especially like this one in the middle. And I think I might have shown the palette already if I have it, the one that's like the Opry Ski. Is that what it was? It's like the winter collection from a while ago that was like all highlighters, but they just made them smaller to be eyeshadow. This is a really nice palette. You get the nice matte brown in there and then this nice matte like tan color. I love that color. Stuff. What I was gonna mention was that I'm super excited that there's some new Marc Jacobs stuff that's starting to pop up at TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross, Marc Jacobs. But I haven't found any of the best stuff, but I did find one of these Marc Jacobs Shameless Youthful Look 24 hour foundation. I might have mentioned this already. I think I found a different color also, but it was like way too light. So I had to give it away. But this one is in the color medium, which I think is gonna be okay for me. It's in the color, color medium. <laughs> Y360. So I guess even if it's like too light, hopefully I can get away with using it for concealer, but we'll see. The price of this was $12.99, which is annoying because I was at Marshall's literally today and I saw one for only $9.99. They got me with price, but I love Marc Jacobs stuff. The packaging of this though is cheaper, but at the same time, I feel like this is gonna be nicer to travel with because it's plastic and usually their stuff is glass. So it, it just makes me nervous to travel with glass, you know? And I've been doing so much traveling lately. If you guys haven't noticed, I'm like never home. <laughs> uh, but so I can't wait to try this. I need to do some more TJ Maxx and Marshalls makeup looks. They're coming, I promise. But so more Marc Jacobs. I picked up two of the lipsticks. I'm slowly growing my collection of these. It's just so much harder to find these lipsticks for some reason. Um, but so these are from the collection, The New Nudes. Um, I don't know why my voice sounds like I'm sick, because I'm not. Um, but so both of these were $8.99. I got them at Marshalls, if that matters. This first color is in the color Anise. Anise. Just sounds weird. But it's just a really light nude color. I figured this would be really nice to put like just in the center of my lips, because I love doing that. I just feel like it's a cute little trick to try to make your lips look bigger. And also I just like want all the colors for a collection. So I don't really discriminate. Um, and so I got this one also, this one is in In The Mood. I don't know why the color, the sticker looks so orange. I guess it's kind of like a peachy orangey nude, but it's super pretty. I don't know what happened, I hit the top. But packaging, I love Marc Jacobs packaging, usually, but always. <laughs> can't think about the taste too much. Then I got a couple of things from Stila, but it's like all the same thing. I picked up some of their, what are these called? They have like different names, but they're all their liquid, liquid glitter eyeshadows, liquid eyeshadows. So this is the glitter and glow liquid eyeshadows. And this is the all fired up set. I have seen so many of these at so many different stores. If you're on the hunt for these, Seriously, I'm throwing out so much good vibes because I feel like you're gonna find it because I've been seeing so many of them. But so this one was $12.99. The prices are weird and they like fluctuate with these little mini sets. But this one is super pretty. Oh my God, did I not even open it yet? I didn't even open this yet. Well, I was gonna like show you guys like the size comparison and everything. But so you get three different colors in here. You get Sunset Fire, Follow the Sun, and burnished, burnished sienna. But these are super cool, super cool, super cute is what I wanted to say, gruel. These are just pretty and they're small, compact and cute and you get three different shades. Versus the full size ones, you're paying $6.99. You're only getting one. This way you're getting three for the price of two. Kind of. But so kind of similar to that, I got another one of the Stila little sets. This one, like I said, the prices are kind of fluctuating. This one was $9.99 is what I got this one for. It is the iridescent set. Again, glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow set. This one I have opened because it's so pretty. But so see, these are like baby small, but they're cute for like travel size. So I'm not really mad at it. And these are so pretty. So this one comes with the color Dollish. It's like, the, oh, it's like a orangey color. Then you get Stylish in the middle and then you get Embellish on this side right here. I just am obsessed with these things. And again, I just have like a collection of them. So I just want all of them. Then I picked up the like regular size ones. So we can kind of see the size difference in them. So here's like the regular size. And then they have, this is their eyeshadow, but then they also have their like glitter and glow liquid highlighters, which are slightly larger. This is the size of the normal eyeshadows compared to the little mini size 
eyeshadow. So it's like this one is 0.153 fluid ounce. <laughs> and then these other ones are not that. It doesn't say on there. These are 0 0.07 fluid ounces per thing. Moving on, I got a few different ones that are like the full size one. So the full size one, I'm pretty sure I got them all for the same price. Yeah, so even I have all of them, but one from Marshalls, the others from TJ Maxx, they were all $6.99. Um, this one is in the color Psychic. So it's actually though from a different collection of them. It's from the Shade Mystere, Shade Mystere liquid eyeshadow sets. So it's like a white though with like a blue iridescent hue to it. Psychic, very, very much pretty. <laughs> and then I got this gorgeous purple one. Is this still, yeah. So this one is still the shade, shade Mystere. And this one is just like a darker blue iridescent to it. And this one is in the color Spellbound. It looks like it's gonna be a purple. It says Kyle, come on, kind of purple. But for some reason, the like packaging is dark blue, <laughs> like a midnight blue. This is the same collection. So the shade Mystere. But so this is like kind of like a yellow goldish hue to it in the color spiritual. Super pretty. So that is everything from this haul for my TJ Maxx and Marshalls. It was definitely a collective haul. I didn't get it all at one time. I got it from a few different stores in Delaware where there's no tanks. So let me know your guys' thoughts if maybe you guys have found any of this stuff that I've shown or if you're on the hunt for it, I'm sure you're gonna find it because like I said, it's the holidays. There's so much more coming out in the store. I got good vibes for you. But also let me know if there's anything that you guys haven't seen me mention yet that you think that I would like and I should be on the hunt for and then I will see if I want to put my monies to it even though I shouldn't be. Give the video a thumbs up if you guys wanna see more of my haul videos, especially going into the holiday season. Maybe I'll do some giveaways. We'll have to see because I'm not supposed to be spending monies. But yeah, I hope you guys subscribe if you haven't yet joined the little family that we have going on here. I hate when people say that. But yeah, muchísimas gracias for watching este video. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.